Today I'm going over how to test a furnace's flame sensor, which here's the wire to it, right on top of the burner right there, that little rod. For testing, what you need to know is what the minimum amount of current is that it will drop out the flame. On this unit, inside the door, it's got this. And so right here, ignition failure, 0.5. Is the lowest its range it wants it to be is four to six so what we're gonna do to test it unplug this now I like to put an alligator clip on my meter test lead so I can just clip that right onto that now I take my other test lead and just plug it right into here one hand is not as easy but it's okay now my meter, I set to UA. Turn the furnace on. Fan's going. There goes my inducer. And let's see. Fan starting, proven switch is made. Now I should send a signal to the board. The board then is gonna send a signal and start energizing up to the igniter, igniter starting to glow. Gas valve should open. And there we go. This is our flame current, 4.6. So it's within its good range. I'm gonna pull and clean and then we'll test again. You can see it's got a little bit, not much, build up on it. It's reinstalled, cleaned up. Let's see if it makes any difference. I mean, it was still in an acceptable range, but on every maintenance, I clean my flame sensors. Something everybody should do. on your maintenance. Well, look, it's up to five. Oh, I wasn't doing that before. So it made a big difference, actually. Until next time, I'm Bill. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'm out. Like and subscribe if you like the video.